On this, On this episode, episode of Free and, and Simple, Simple, we're hitching up, heading out, and weighing our airstream for the very first time. Hitch, which we love. And uh, we do it by hand because we don't have a cord to sell. Get hitched. <laughs> hitched. It's our house, you know? Yeah, I do. I don't think I'm the only one who's a little cautious of hitching, am I? Paranoia, paranoia. Time to get the cat. This is their favorite part. So what we like to do is put one of the t-shirts we slept in from the night before in there so they have our smell and get the cat's bed to put in there and spray it with Feel away. We are almost out. Time to go in the truck. More feel away. You ready? You go. All right, we're ready to go. All right, we're on the road, headed to get the thing weighed. Right, Wendell? I mean. Does anyone else feel nervous like every time you hitch up and go? Or is that just because we've been doing this still for less than two months? <laughs> Turn left onto Michigan 83 South. So uh, this is my position. I, I ride with the cats in the back seat because they get a little stressed. So I just give Wendell some love and he'll cu cuddle up and purr in a minute. Right, babe? That would be amazing. So we saw this YouTube video from this other YouTubers, yeah. Love, Love Subbin, I think, right? Yeah, here's their video. Welcome to Love Subbin, episode 41. Today we're gonna talk about weighing your trailer and when you should weigh your trailer. Their video inspired us and it kind of let us know where to go. We knew to look up cat scales yeah. to find them. And uh, so thanks Love Subbin for the advice that you didn't even know you were giving us. And let's, um, let's go to Perry, Michigan, weigh Jolly. And the truck too, which, does the truck have a name? Not yet. All right, cat scale, where you at? Oh, I see it. Right there. Okay, so can I just go on? So what happened? You have Tire on each weighing area. Oh, here. All right, first way or reway? Yes, first way. Give me just one moment. Or set, we'll see you inside. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. So now we're gonna see how much our truck weighs. How much do we weigh? I don't know yet. What, you didn't look? Nope. 6580, so we're a thousand under. Yeah, so our truck weighs, I think. We don't know what any of this means. Help us know what this means, people who know things. All right, so we've learned a few things since we filmed this video. We've asked the people who know things. <laughs> and thank you. 
Uh, we asked Airstream Addicts to start. That's who we always ask. And they were super helpful. Basically, we needed another way to have a base way. That's what everybody was saying. So, so we got another way. We weighed our truck. The first way was truck plus Airstream. First That's way. That's total weight. Subtract Second. the weight of the truck only equals the weight of the airstream i think right at least that's what some of the pros said and then just to double check we asked one of our favorite pros patrick botticelli hello and welcome back to colonial airstream i'm patrick botticelli and he confirmed our hunch that we were pretty much a thousand pounds below our weight yeah he sent us an email and he said that we take the trailer axle weight, which is 6,580. We add 10% for the portion of the tongue weight on the axle, comes to 6,700, which is 1,000 under the max gross vehicular weight ratio. Rating? Ratio? What does the R stand for? Rating. So our trailer should be good. So what we learned is that it's not enough just to pull onto a cat scale and weigh your truck and your Airstream together. You actually need to weigh your truck or your Airstream separately as well. All right, now let's uh, finish up the video. Are, are we good? Maybe we're just, I think we're good. I don't know. Okay, uh, time to hit the road and head to West Michigan. Till next time, stay, stay jolly. jolly. You're down a notch or two and, and increase, increase your, your quality, quality of life. life. <laughs> Raise that hitch.